I want to share with you a little secret to what makes people pay premium and increasing the profitability of what you're offering. There are four key stages to the way that people look at the psychology of this. The first stage is where we talk about price. For those of you that might be you know, experienced in the sales arena, you know that when you talk about price and price is the central focus of the conversation, then it's always a race to the bottom. And so what we want to ensure is that we elevate the conversation more than a pricing conversation because it is a race to the bottom and then discounts and inappropriate appropriate comparisons happen in the marketplace. The next level as we you know climb the staircase here is really about the product and so this is where often what will happen is people start comparing the features and they start comparing the benefits of what it is that you offer and I really encourage you to put together what are the features and benefits um, and and what is it that you're communicating and, and how can you deliver that from the point of authority and from a point of credibility and is that really being communicated to your market and the problem with a, a product distinction and only talking about features and benefits is that generally what will happen is your market is not getting the communication of the authority and the differences that make the difference. And so this conversation is then de-elevated back to a pricing conversation where inappropriate comparisons are made. So what we need to do is we need to start to elevate the conversation that one bit further and we actually start talking about the problem that is going to be solved. And so when we're having a conversation about the problems that are going to be solved, when we talk about the problems that are solved, people are starting to connect with the emotions that are actually going to be rewarded or solved or alleviated as a result of solving that problem. Before I said, you know, how do you deal with objections about price? And I said, just make sure that they don't come up. This is part of the way in which you pitch and part of the, your sales presentation, which obviously should be mapped in the context of building credibility authority, answering the questions that alleviate the problems that your prospect is experiencing. And when someone connects with that emotionally and it solves a need for them and that problem will be solved, then ultimately what happens is there are no objections because people see that as an investment that's being made. 